Lizzie Zaru here. Today I'm so excited. One of my close friends, um, some of you may have watched her YouTube channel. She was really big on YouTube um, and she chose to get off of YouTube for such amazing reasons. Um, I probably think a lot of you follow her on social media, on Instagram and her podcast, um, Chelsea Hijab Love. Um, she makes scarves for love. That's her company. And she also has Chelsea the label which she's going to be having a whole line of clothing come out, you know, God allowing some time further down the road this year. But this year on Friday, March, this is March, yeah, March 30th, she is launching her biggest collection yet. And she, I mean, yeah, of course she didn't care if I do this video, but um, the woman sells out fast. So <laughs> she makes amazing scarves. And if you want to get your hands on a scarf, I mean, I get that it's like her biggest collection yet, but you're going to want to go and check out her site um, this weekend to see if you can get your hands on one of these because they sell out so fast. The one on my head, she did something really cool. So as a designer, of course, you're always looking for different sources of inspiration. And something she did was she put it on social media, on Instagram, and she asked all of her followers to submit um, pictures and colors and just things that inspire them. And, you know, she wanted to see if, like, she could draw inspiration from what inspires her customers. And I just think that's so cool, like, just listening to the people who buy your scarves. Anyway, I happened to just um, look up a picture. It was a beautiful black woman. Um with um she had a darker skin tone than mine and it was just oh my gosh it was so beautiful the melanin was popping <laughs> and you know i really appreciate that um you know this model you know was given a chance to model because still dark-skinned women do not get the chance to be models supermodels you know as much I mean yeah it's getting better but still you know anyway so I submitted that picture she had a really beautiful um, turban twist wrap and it was like a violet magenta purple going on and I just thought oh man like that's so cool and I know Chelsea could take those colors that color palette and do something really awesome with it of course as a black woman I want colors and you know designs to to be based off inspiration of my skin tone too you know like we always get these colors a lot of times in like these fashion collections that were based on white or light-skinned women and that's fine like you know we've been doing fine all this time but it's just cool for like once <laughs> for someone to draw inspiration for for from what colors look like on our skin tones and that's exactly what she did this here and then she let me name it she let all the people that she chose as winners she let them name and help design like not help design but help like name <laughs> the scarves and choose certain color palettes um for the design so anyway i chose i'm not creative she's creative i'm not creative so i chose to name this beauty it's so beautiful um zara so this is a Zara. I really hope it sells out. If not, I'm going to feel a little bit salty. <laughs> but I got, um, she sent me this one for free as a, as a thank you and like kind of like a giveaway, like winning um, for the inspiration thing. And it's funny because she didn't even realize like, like I sent her that one. Anyway, I, I, I love this scarf. Like I try not to wear it too much. So, you know, I don't get like over it but it's just so beautiful you guys can see the design I mean she really took these browns I don't know if you guys can even see that but you know these browns and like these really dark colors really really dark browns and um, this like magenta and purple and these blues and I oh, don't man it's just so cool anyway I really love this scarf this is not the only scarf that I have um, from scarf for love um, I also wanted to mention that it's really cool that she makes these scarves that are organic and she doesn't like hire any slaves to be doing the work like these are ethically made 
and like through and through and she does a, like all of it herself and she's a mom of two boys like who has time Psh, I don't know I don't even know how she does it she amazes me um, and she's like super on top of like her Islamic studies too it's crazy like, this, this woman does a lot anyway um, it's important to note that a portion of the sales actually goes to to charity and I don't know that just it's one of the reasons why we're friends her heart is just so pure and she's just got such a good heart but I think sometimes people don't even realize like you know people are not making a whole bunch of money off of scarves like a lot of the time people are giving money to charity and you just don't realize it but anyway this was one of the first scarves I ever got um, it's like this beautiful beige kind of green color I don't remember the name so all of these scarves have names that she came up with and that like customers help come up with and name I don't think this is a GI Jane it might be she's gonna have to comment <laughs> and correct me um, whenever she watches this but I don't think it's a GI Jane maybe it is I don't think it is it's it's like a sandy stone wash I don't know but I love it I got it because I needed something neutral but still like with some sort of pattern or something and so this is so soft it's feels different than this one of course I've washed this one so maybe that's why but I don't know if the fabrics um, different I know she uses cotton and bamboo and she might use Jersey I'm not sure which Jersey is cotton right anyway this one I do know this one well I think this one is called autumn pretty sure this one's called autumn I love it I bought it last well this fall this well this past fall I mean can you guys can you guys see this I'm like trying to hold them up so you guys can see these so cool just tie-dye and I don't know really beautiful and what I like is that like this is a lot of fabric you can throw it around you like this you could wrap it around you as a cover-up you can wear it you know when it's cold outside literally I guess as a neck scarf makes for an amazing turban you can do a lot of things with these um, this one is similar to this one I think in fabric um, so maybe they're the same thing I don't know I like it this one I'm almost certain this is a GI Jane and I had my eye on this for like she launched like two or three times and I kept missing it and then um, this to get this one I think I actually like sat by the computer and I was like you know she wants to be fair and she doesn't want to like constantly put things on hold you know just because you have a private relationship with her but um, if I would have asked she might she may have put it to the side for me anyway <laughs> this is a GI Jane I love it it's probably one of her best sellers I'm not sure on that she'll have to fact check me again but look at this detail man like that's just so BA I just love her heart for making things like you know scarves and hijabs and just clothing that's beautiful and cool and that you feel good in and it, that's still modest I think a lot of people feel like oh you're Muslim or oh you're modest you're a modest woman you just have to like wear black and brown and you know nothing's wrong with that that's what you want to do but like that's not like a rule and then this one I don't know what it's called it's like a pixie or like a not pixie I don't know it's lavender and it's beautiful and it's purple like purple punk or something I don't know I have no idea what this is called what this is called all of them have names though <laughs> and if you go to I will link it below but if you go to scarves for love you will be able to find I don't know if she's gonna in all of these same colors it's a new mega collection so she's gonna have scarves that like like uh, there's one like stargazer big seller I'm pretty sure she brought that one back um, so she's gonna have ones that she did that were huge 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 sellers um, and then she's gonna have new designs like I think she just did like this blush like this really soft kind of cashmere blush pink I actually want that one so I might have to text her <laughs> and be like yo can you put it to the side anyway um, once again I just wanted to get on here you guys ask me all the time where I get these scarves I've worn this one in a video 
I think I've worn this one in a video and then this one is on my social media like all the time so I, I always get asked and instead of always having to respond and link everything I can now just point people to this video and all of you who've watched this video can just follow her on social media and follow um, Scarves for Love and you get to see all of the new announcements first. It's amazing. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It's not sponsored. She didn't pay me. She don't need to pay anybody to sell her scarves. Trust me, these things sell out super fast. I, again, just always get asked. And so I figured why not show, show all my little, my little mini collection off as well as my brand new Zara scarf. No one has this right now. It's just me. I'm the only one with it. <laughs> I'm just going to bask in that till Friday. I'm the only one with the Zara. Uh, anyway, you guys can go get this scarf starting March 30th. I believe that's Friday. I don't know what time she's launching, but if you follow her again on social media, you will be able to see the time that she's launching, God allowing. And like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys later or soon, God allowing. Bye, everyone.